okay uh, firstly we will set up the DSP kit so uh, its setup is very easy uh, you have to simply connect the DC power supply to the kit uh, this is the DC power supply you have to connect it here so it will start up your kit and the some LEDs are blinking and second thing you need is the power supply, uh, the USB the USB you have to connect on this particular port so another uh, and the uh, other side of the USB you have the uh, USBs uh, you have to connect to the laptop and some another things you need is the speakers and the uh, wires for the audio input okay now uh, open the CD which you have had with your kit in this CD uh, you have to launch this particular setup and you have to click on install products we have to install the drivers and the code composer studio the code composer studio uh, is used to make your programs for the uh, DSK and uh, if you have to connect your kit to the MATLAB then you again need the CCS and the drivers you need to uh, connect to your kit with your computer and make sure this kit works with only Windows XP you have to click on install products and you have to install C6000 code, code composer studio version 3.1 and second thing you have to install is DSK613 drivers and target content after installing these two things you will get four menu icons just so you have to exit it and you have to go on the desktop you will get four uh, icons one is the setup CCS and second one is the uh, one is the setup CCS and second one is the DSK CCS studio third one CCS studio and fourth one is DSK diagnostic so firstly you have to open this diagnostic center uh, this uh, diagnostic center is used uh, to check whether your uh, drivers are properly installed or whether your kit is okay all your memory and Kodak whether everything is working or not so when this DSK diagnostic center is open so you have to click on start here you have to click on start firstly it will start your testing your USB diagnostic and okay uh, it's showing USB device is not an emirated or plugged in oh so so we can again connect the U we can open the USB and we can again connect the USB so fail to emulate it just just close this thing so um, after closing uh, it will testing the USB diagnostic and any uh, emulation diagnostics DSP diagnostics so you have to click on start again so it's testing all the ex uh, components like external memory flash diagnostic Kodak diagnostic LED diagnostic and DIP switches and uh, uh, if all the testing is being done then it will uh, show you pass see on the kit uh, the LEDs are blinking so it's saying pass so, so that means your kit is okay so second thing what you have to do is you have to click on advanced after clicking on advanced you have to go on LED switch LED SWT okay so after clicking LED SWT if you will click on start so uh, now uh, you can see on the kit that all the LEDs are blinking so suppose you are pressing a button here 
so it will close this particular LED it will switch off the LED uh, first one second one third one fourth one so that means y you can check that your all the LEDs are working or just see here switch off and on the same time if you will see on the software the uh, particular LED is getting switch off you can see it here that this particular LED is getting off if you're pressing the button like this first one second one third fourth all this so like this you can see that your uh, kit is working so what you have to do now you have to stop this software you have to stop this software and you have to come out of this software just make it close sorry just make it close and now uh, you have to open this setup CCS studio version 3.1 open this uh, as we have to use the code composer studio it may know that uh, which uh, DSP platform we are, we are going to use so this setup utility will help us to select that particular DSK so when it the setup CCS will open then we have to select DSK 6013 it is opening okay so now it's open just see that uh, I have already uh, added this particular TSK so if suppose if I am removing this TSK suppose because in this starting you will not get this particular DSK here so you have to connect uh, click on that particular DSK this one and you have to click on add button so now it will add this particular TSK uh, to your studio setup so now you have to click on exit and save so it will uh, uh, ask you to start the code composer studio click yes here so now uh, we have settled up your kit uh, so now uh, the next work is uh, on the mm, this kit is by spectrum digital so on the website of spectrum digital we have the example codes uh, for this particular kit so uh, we can download that uh, uh, examples and we can test that examples mm, I can show you from where you have to mm, uh, download that example codes for this kit you have to go on spectrum digital website spectrum mm, digital sorry it's uh, written like digital so you have to go on spectrum digital website Parallels opening the Code Composer Studio also. So this is the Spectrum Digital website, uh, and uh, you can uh, refine this search like Spectrum Digital, and you can uh, write DSK six and one three also. So we're writing six one three. Seven one three. Now you have to click on the second one, the second link. Mm, this is the link for that Spectrum Digital website for this particular DSK. below it's, it's opening the code composer studio also so you have to go on spectrum digital with this kit we can uh, do the audios and uh, uh, 
here it's written that DSK six and one three sport page. You have to click here. Now it will open the all these sporting documents with this kit. So it's written here the target content includes board sport library, GEL and example test. You have to download this file.